Series back at the U.S. Nationals. We saw a couple of huge engine explosions. Terry McMillan and Clay Milliken immediately come to mind. So when you have something like that, what is the cause? Well, that's why we're going to take a look at it. We saw a tremendous amount of explosions. And a lot of people said it was just Indy. But hey, let's take a look at the anatomy of a top fuel explosion, focusing on Clay Milliken. At 1.6 seconds, it drops the number one cylinder, and the blower boost goes from 52 to 55 pounds per square inch, not making the engine happy. Then at 3.8 seconds, it drops at number three. The boost goes from 51 to 55 to 61 pounds of boost. And then it's really not happy, and that causes number seven and eight connecting rods right out the side of the block. As you notice right there, you see the rod cap coming out, shredding the belt. It did say the blower and the ejector, but everything below that was pretty much gone, as you see on that list. The cost of that was probably right around 25 grand. Oh, it was worth the 25 grand just to see the rod cap go. <laughs> bouncing through the air.